be great. Um, you mentioned the CBS interview that will be airing this weekend. What was the impetus for the president to decide to sit for that interview? I mean, look, the president has always said that he wanted, he wants to uh, do interviews, speak in a way speak directly to the American people. One way to do that is to do interviews uh, with, with you all. Uh, and so that is something that he wanted to do, a sit-down interview. I'm not going to get into the specifics. You guys will see. They will promote. Uh, obviously, is CBS there a will promote. You're to get across? I, I mean, look, the message with, uh, for this president has always been the same, right, which is he's going to do everything that he can to deliver for the American people, to, do, uh, to work on issues that they care about, whether it's the economy, whether it's about freedom and democracy, uh, whether it's about making sure that we look lower cost, those are things that the president is always very clear about. I'm not going to get ahead of the interview. He did an interview. Uh, he was happy to do it. Uh, and I think, uh, stay tuned, you all will see what his message is and what the interview was all about. Uh, but you know, we're hoping, uh, obviously, we'll uh, continue to, he'll continue to talk and take questions from you all uh, in the next five months. Um, during that time, how is he thinking about using his executive authority to achieve anything left on his to-do list. And appreciate the question. I'm not going to get ahead of, ahead of the president on um, any exec potential executive actions that he might uh, take on any important issue that matters to the American people. What I can say is he wants to build on the historic record that he has been able uh, to lay out and deliver for the American people. That's his focus. I'm not going to get in ahead of the and president. Has he spoken to Vice President Harris after last night's rally? Well, I they definitely spoke, as I we mentioned uh, yesterday from here. Uh, the vice president called the president uh, ahead of the announcement of her running mate. Uh, so they had a conversation. They speak regularly. Uh, they are partners in this, as you know, uh, and have a close relationship. I just don't have anything to read out outside of that.